as you know, we are in Dubai Summit 2022. Who are you? Can you explain yourself briefly for us? I started working in IT uh, in Oracle for 10 years. Yeah. I started investing in crypto, made money, lost money. And then I realized, no, that's the technology. I started reading a lot in it and I started my master. So I done my um, blockchain and cryptocurrency master and I cho joined Chainalysis. So Chainalysis is a company for blockchain analytics. We work with the government, we work with the central banks, with the law enforcement to really build trust in the blockchain. Um, to stop the scams, to stop the uh, illicit activity that is related to the crypto and actually again to build that kind of trust in the blockchain mm -hmm. and if it wasn't trust in the blockchain we would not be here today when bitcoin maybe six seven years back i think you can agree with me with your family it's a scam it's related to drugs it's related exactly. to stolen funds we are changing this now so as we know you are a speaker in this platform uh, what kind of topics did you speak uh, this platform? It was regarding the DeFi risks. Yeah. So what is it? Yeah. DeFi risk, I can say, it's a, it's a kind of a technology. And I do believe personally in the technology. Because DeFi is doing to the traditional finance is what social media did to the newspaper. Yeah. Um, it is a democracy of finance. It's how the, really the idea of Bitcoin when it started is to reach to the unbanked. Those people in Africa, those people in Afghanistan, where they, have, they don't have those kind of bank accounts to give them access to their assets and to give them asset, access to their assets in a safe way. So, but at the same time, there is lots of risk. There is a risk when it comes to schemes. There is risk that it comes to the hacking. If you know Axa Infinity case, the gaming company, uh, it was hacked for $600 million. So based on uh, our research and analysis, in 2021, it was $3.2 billion hacked. What is the risk for you exactly? What is the risk exactly? Can you explain briefly? For a normal person, is to lose his assets. Yeah. The risk for anyone, he might be involved by mistake in illicit activity, and he might be blacklisted or fined. Yeah. That's the risk, and that's what we don't want that to happen. I would like to ask the blockchain-based games. Do you interesting blockchain-based games, by the way? And it is huge now. When we're talking about, we just mentioned Axa Infinity. Um, they just started and look at them now. But at the same time, uh, they had their own tokens, but there was no proper ways to understand who they're working with, and that's what happened with the, with the stolen funds. Some people explain to play to concept, equal, uh, click to earn. Do you agree with that? It depends about how the game is built. Yeah. So it's completely different. So we cannot categorize all, for example, all social media mm -hmm. as just browsing. So it's all different. And if you come with a technology or with a game uh, that can really add something and add kind of value, why not? Uh, what would you like to say future of blockchain based games? Can you share your thoughts? It will increase because look at us now the metaverse is still coming and the games will be more into the metaverse yeah. we take a look to the news watch the news what is going on in saudi for example how much they're investing now yeah. in gaming company this gaming company is not done just for uh, 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 web 2.0 it is for 3.0 and 3.0 will never be without NFTs, it will not be without tokens. And those games will also will not be without token and NFT. And we're talking about playing to earn tokens, playing to earn different avatars, playing to earn NFTs. Yeah. And that's how it will be in the future. We need to monetize it. And they, it started already. It started to monetize it. You heard about that kid that he bought two apartments in the Philippines from playing in Axa Infinity. It's happening. What would you like to say to Turkey? Because Turkey how maybe 16 16 percent the people uh they are interested in crypto and blockchain technology what would you like to say to them i can we are also from turkey by the way yeah, yeah very pleasure to meet you i was there in the same event yeah. a couple of months back uh, we Stumble. have partner yes we have partners in turkey we see how it's growing i appreciate what is going now uh, yeah. when it comes to the regulators and the and the central bank yeah. that they want to have the cfi which is traditional finance 
So we can see that it is evolving in the right direction, if it happens correctly, which is having the banks really communicating and custodian the assets yeah. for the, uh, for the uh, citizens. And I can see how crypto is even advertised in the airport and in the buses outside. Yeah, that yeah, that's give credibility to the crypto. The whole idea, I think if Satoshi now uh, saw what's going on t in, in Turkey, he would be very happy because yeah, exactly. that's power to the people. That's giving power to the people. Uh, but again... Thanks for accept our request. It was so nice conversation with you, sir. Thank you. CDS is coming. We are with Saif Jabri. How are you, sir? I'm fine, thank you. How are things? Yeah, everything's going well. How did you find this event? What do you think about this event? This event is uh, active and uh, fruitful, actually. Uh, we had learned more uh, and more about the cryptocurrency market and blockchain uh, new technologies that we haven't ever heard about it yet. What would you like to say uh, about the blockchain technology? Uh, blockchain technology is a trending technology that not the majority of uh, people knows about it. And also, uh, it's the advanced technology or the next level of uh, innovation and creativity. Well, the question is, uh, what are you doing? Uh, do you have any task or any company, especially about the cryptocurrency or the blockchain, something like that? We are uh, expert in uh, process automation using the recent technologies and the newest technologies, which is, uh, uh, which is the, the blockchain uh, technology and other AI technology that are available in the market and between innovative people and also between other guys uh, that are working on this community. Last question is, what would you like to say for crypto fun? They are the best. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.